Hello everyone, my name is Rafiat and you're welcome back to my YouTube channel. In this video, I'm going to show you how to make Zobo the healthy way. Not only is Zobo refreshing, it is also very very easy to make using readily available ingredients and it has a lot of health benefits. So first we have Zobo leaves. Zobo leaves are medicinal, they are good for weight loss programs, they are also good for digestive system generally and it has also been reported to be good for the management of high blood pressure. Our second ingredient is pineapple. I also use cucumber, I use some cloves and I use some star anise. Star anise is optional but I like them in my Zobo drinks. And lastly, I use some ginger. You see, very easy ingredients. I'll put more of the details concerning the ingredients in the description box below. The first thing to do is to slice the washed cucumber. We're adding this to our recipe because of the nutritional benefits as well as the flavor. Even though the flavor is mild, it goes a long way. Now over to the pineapple. Go ahead and peel the pineapple, thoroughly wash pineapple and do not discard the peel of this pineapple because it is a source of flavor, major source of flavor to Zobo drink. So, and that's another reason why you have to wash the pineapple very well so that you can use the peel without any fear of, you know, um, sand, organisms and all that. Another very important thing to note is that since we're going to be using the pineapple as a sweetener for this recipe, please make sure that the pineapple is ripe, very, very ripe because it's like our source of sugar in quotes. <laughs> we're not going to be using sugar. But the pineapple has to be very ripe so that it can provide enough sweetness for this Zobo drink. Now go ahead and transfer the pineapple chunks into a blender, add the ginger, add some water and blend until smooth. I'm just going to pass the blended pineapple through a sieve. This is just so that the juice can drain out. And to make draining easy, you can use a spoon to stir continuously. Continue this until all the juice has passed through the sieve and you're going to be left with this very 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 sweet pineapple juice Now that we are done with all that let's go ahead and make the zobo proper Add the zobo leaves into a pot, add the pineapple peel which is a massive source of flavor Add the star anise, add the cloves, they are also sources of flavor and nutrients as well Then add some water and finally the cucumber slices i like my water level to be slightly above the level of the other ingredients or at the same level cover the pot and allow this to boil for about 20 minutes i feel it's important to mention this please pay attention there is another method of making zobo where you add the blended pineapple without passing it through a sieve just after blending pour the pineapple into the pot containing the zobo leaves that's another method of making this so you don't have to go through the, um, the whole process of passing through a sieve now the reason why i don't like to use that method is because heat over time denatures and destroys vitamin c which is a major component of pineapple you get so i prefer to juice the pineapple and mix it with the zobo liquid that way i am sure that the vitamin c is still intact so once you're done taking out the liquid from the pot you can set this aside and use for future zobo making process it is still very good all you have to do is add some water and boil again this is another very important part of my zobo making process i use a ratio which i formulated to make sure that my zobo turns out nice without having to add sugar i use the ratio 2 is to 1, 2 ratio 1 and honestly it works for me all the time. So from this recipe I got 1 liter of the Zobo itself which means that I have to add 500 ml of the freshly juiced pineapple and once I do that I'm good to go. So 2 ratio 1, 2 parts of the Zobo itself to 1 part of the pineapple juice. So with this ratio, you can make absolutely any quantity of Zobo and it will still turn out nice and flavorful. But don't forget the rule, make sure you use ripe and sweet pineapple, very important. And just like that, in really easy and straightforward steps, we have just made healthy and refreshing Zobo drink. Trust me, you're going to love this when you try it out and feel free to send me your feedbacks. I'm going to drop the link to my different social media platforms so that you can easily reach me and send me your feedbacks. 
please guys subscribe to my youtube channel and drop a comment like this video and all those really nice things <laughs> thank you so much for watching bye